Welcome to this video guys. Let's see how we can install pip in Visual Studio Code. To first check if it is actually installed or not, what I'll do is I'll just type pip install and then pandas. If I hit enter, as you can see, you'll see this message that says pip is not recognized. So this means that pip is not yet added to environment variable or it is not installed. So let's fix this error. First go to this URL here. I'll have this link in the description below. Now scroll down and you will see this link here. Right click on it and click on save link as. This will download this link. Now you can download it anywhere you want. So I'll just download it in uh, downloads folder and you'll have to access this later. So once this is downloaded, go to your downloads folder and now you need to open your command prompt here. So I'll type CMD in this address bar in Windows and then hit enter and command prompt will open. So this is a shortcut here. So as you can see, command prompt has opened already inside our downloads folder where we have this get pip.py file. Okay, so now just type this command python get pip.py and you can hit tab to autocomplete. So I just typed get and then hit tab and this is auto completed. Now press enter and pip will be installed. Once pip has been installed, you need to add this path to environment variable. So this is where pip is installed in my case. So you'll also see something like this and you can copy this from here. Okay, now if you're not seeing this path, this is actually the same thing. You just have to replace this, this part with your username. So if you're not seeing this path, this path is actually inside your C drive, inside your users, and then inside your current user. Okay, so after that, it's the same thing. So this is the first part. And after that, you can just copy this app data part. Okay, now press Windows key and type environment variable so that we can access it from Visual Studio Code and any other terminal. Click on environment variables double click on this path here, double click on this bottom row here and paste the path that we have just copied. So this is the first part. If you are seeing this, you can copy the whole thing or if you have uh, just the first part like I have done here till your username, you can just copy this later and again, double click on this and paste it here. So I'll just remove this mistake here. So it's users and then your username and then app data local and then so on. Click OK, OK, OK again. I'll close this now. Let's go back to our Visual Studio Code. And if I try to run this again, this time also I'm getting this error. So what I'll do is I'll restart it. I'll close this and then open Visual Studio Code again. And this time, let's run this pip install pandas again. And this time, as you can see, I'm not getting any error and the installation has started. So this is how you can install pip in Visual Studio Code. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.